a month ago, one of our clients, StressFreeHealthOptions.com, as an as an accessory, as a as an extra, uh, the insurance companies were throwing in telemedicine, and people very people liked yeah, it. Right. People liked it, and people said, "Oh, I get telemedicine. You know, I get a sore throat. I don't have to go see the doctor. I can just go online. I don't have to leave my bed. I'm tired. I'm sick. I don't feel good." Now, and you can see it on all the advertising everywhere. Now, telemedicine is not an accessory or uh, something to use as something as an extra to sell. Now it's a necessity. Now, if you're sick, you need telemedicine. You need your carrier to have telemedicine and offer telemedicine, which they all are, thank God, uh, because they know the, the reality. So in situations like this, we find out that uh, uh, you know, businesses surge. Uh, 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 certain businesses, you know, struggle, but other things come up that are a necessity. Uh, uh, necessity is the mother of, an, of all invention. That's right. And telemedicine was one of those things that when uh, when uh, the stress-free customer would ask, we say, "Oh, by the way, it's telemedicine." Just like we would say, you know, in uh, in uh, in Medicare, you would you would you know, now you get free hearing aids or free uh, food or free rides to the doctor. That was all like an extra part of it. That's wasn't right. your main thing. Your main thing was pay my medical bills. The pay, what's my deductible? Right. What's my thing? Now it's not just that. Now telemedicine has become, and of course, the hearing aid and and stuff like that was important to the person who had problems hearing. But since not everybody did, other people said, "Well, great, you include hearing aids, but I don't, I don't need them." Now telemedicine is something everybody needs. Every household has to have telemedicine because your kids, you. Your, your, your elderly parents, you know, we're going through that with, you're going through it with kids, sure. I'm going through it with my elderly uh, mother, you know, I don't want to pick her up and take her to the doctor, but I'd rather show up, go on Wi-Fi, pop up a, a thing, reach her doctor on my laptop and, t and tell the doctor this, this, and the beautiful thing about it is that they can prescribe based on what you're doing, and it's a doctor prescribing. It's not going on Google and finding out, you know, hey, what's it's a real, what's, it's what's a real medical the doctor? Four hundred and fifty thousand yeah. causes that can cause me a sore throat. No, it's a medical doctor evaluating you online, like you said, maybe even sending you a test to That's your right. house. No, they're doing it. Doing your test, and then sending back the results. And getting it without having to go out. And In then, situations like this, you that's what you have to do. And then they call you back, and then they schedule your follow-up with yeah. your test results, and they say, are you in front of your computer? Go online. Yeah. You know, talk about elderly parents. My, 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 my parents are in their 70s, and my dad uh, switches cardiologist, and he had a follow-up appointment. And mm -hmm. guess how he's doing his follow-up appointment this week? Through telemedicine. So the our value system changes right our, our hierarchy of values change yeah. the way in which products are now looked at so it, health insurance for like and I, I had that conversation with with uh, the, the board members of stress free uh, yesterday uh, because they're seeing more of an influx right of phone calls coming in just how do I use this how do I use that how and now the conversation is remember we told you about the telemedicine yeah. well perfect and then so now the, like you said, the, that, the the consumers are no longer looking at the brand. They're not looking. Is it uh, you know high brand? Is it uh, do they cover my deductible? This is no no no. What 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 what? How can I use it? Is this usable today for yeah. the situation that we have? And so all products are going through that today. All services are going through that. Yeah. A reevaluation of what yeah. is the real value here, or the yeah. so the real solution to the end con, end yeah. user here. Yeah. And um, so delivery, yeah. delivery. delivery. You know, restaurants are going to survive, hopefully, most of them, some of them at least, through delivery. And I heard a statistic that Uber, Lyft is like dead because they don't do delivery. Uber is down 50%. And the only reason that it's up is because they do the Uber Eats and Uber has the food delivery. That's what's keeping them in business because if nobody's going out and nobody's going to restaurants and nobody's driving, nobody's going anywhere, Uber's down. Such a big company that started and made made so much and became so big, so now, fast, so fast. Now Uber and, and a great idea and a fantastic sure. idea. I mean, we, uh, who doesn't love to be able to Uber? You know, where you have to go and and, and, and and situations like where you know traffic, parking, situations like that. But uh, they're they're suffering, but they're staying alive because of their Uber Eats. People are in and they're ordering food. They need food, and, and people are delivering food to their house. It's four key things that we apply, right? in our businesses that, that I think that, that that's 
uh, especially in, in, in turbulent businesses, right? Like the healthcare business that we're also, we have clients in the healthcare business. I've been in the healthcare business also for a very long time. So those are very turbulent businesses. Um, lack of capital is a reason why companies don't make it sometimes, okay? Um, although it, it, today there's so much capital out in the universe, out there's so many resources that, that if somebody wanted to, needed some capital, they could get it, right? But that's one of the reasons. The second reason is um, they don't provide a superior product or service, mm -hmm. right? So, like they say, the, 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 you know, the, when, when the tide is down, right, you see everybody who's naked. Yeah, right. <laughs> when the tide is up, you don't know who's naked or not, right? right? right. So, you know, if, if, you know, companies who are not providing a superior service, a superior product, right, superior content, they're not going to make it. Yeah. Um, the third thing is having a predictable way of acquiring new audience members, new leads, new customers, new acquisitions, right? It, it, whatever that, 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 that means to your business. Um, and the fourth one is being able to adapt quickly to the market demands. And so, you know, Uber, perfect example. They entered the market, they grabbed all the lion's share, for, they, they owned it, they created it, right? They, they, made, they, they were a market maker. Somebody came in, took market share from there. They continue to provide a superior product or service, and they adapted by saying, we're going to go ahead and add this service. And because of that, that's the difference between Lyft and Uber, yeah, right? Yeah. So those four things in business, those are all, again, didn't matter the corona, don't matter the 1999 bubble, the 2008, 2020 corona, the 2030, keep predicting, keep going, 20, yeah. it's a cycle, it's, it's yeah. life, this happens, right? Yeah, this right. is, this is, you know. It sneaks up on you. This is, this is how it happens, right? But your ability to be able to stay focused, adapt, adapt quickly, to the new market demands, because again, my biz, our business isn't what we want it to be, it's what our customers are demanding from yeah, us. Yeah, okay? yeah. Um, and then being able to continue to do that, I think that, that that's where you're gonna see the winners, right? Yeah, and so, and yeah. sometimes, like winners, right? Like in any 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 sport, any yeah. a runner, right? You, you you know you're going there and you're running towards the race, and you don't know you're two, you're second, you're third, you could be 10, you're just going, right? Yeah. And that ability to keep persevering uh, and doing the, the fundamental things that work. Yeah.